Thank you, Mr. Speaker, sir. In his answer, the Honorable Minister mentioned about the commitment of Meta towards uh, Mauritius. Uh, does this imply that uh, ever since this commitment has been uh, agreed on, let's say, let's put it that way, uh, the cases reported on uh, META, uh, is it taking more time or is it, is it, is it being uh, like, you know, uh, we are find, finding solutions as soon as possible because so far, as far as I have been putting questions here, we have been reporting so many pages fake profiles, but nothing has been done. But does this commitment, uh, you know, guarantees us that as from now on, all the reported pages, fake profiles would be taken down? Uh, Mr. Speaker, sir, um, I have gathered some figures for the last year, July 2021 till July, as a date, there has been 2,465 incidents related to Facebook that have been reported on the online platform system, that is the MOCOS, the Mauritian Online Reporting System, which is uh, overlooked by the CERT, the Computer Emergency Response Team. And those complaints and incidents have been reported and referred to Meta for action. Out of which I've been informed that 2,189 cases, that is nearly 90% of those um, cases reported has been resolved, compared to June 2020 to June 2021, where only 10% were resolved. So it has indeed increased. It has indeed been uh, worked out in a very correct manner. Uh, that as of now, things are moving quite fast compared to before. And I, I, I guess, Mr. Speaker, I can confirm that probably that um, there have been recruitment of Mauritian national being, including diaspora, to look after these contents and actions have been taken accordingly. At the same time, Mr. Speaker, sir, um, the House will recall that the new cyber security and cybercrime bill was passed in this August Assembly in November 2021, and the Act came into operational in December of last year. And this new legislation, let me remind, criminalizes offenses related to cybercrime and cybersecurity, such as misuse of fake profile, uh, cyberbullying, extortion, and so on. So um, the law also is there, Mr. Speaker, sir, to take actions against anybody that uh, goes against the law.